So this is a place in Indiana. It's called, uh, the, the name of the place is actually uh, Almost Heaven Lawnmower Graveyard. And yes, that is actually the name. Uh, I'm just going to give you a little tour here of the place. I just thought it was kind of cool. I mean, they got stuff from push mowers. Kind of hard to see stuff that it's in the snow, but hopefully you can get the idea. Just uh, all kinds of stuff. I'm going to kind of show stuff as good as I can. So uh, I'm going to put the link to their Facebook page in the description. And uh, of course the date of this video is when I did record it. So this is what they have as of now. Their stock changes. I'd say daily, actually, so. They got a lot of different, they got basically, actually I don't think they basically, it's, they've got every brand of everything here, so. If you guys need any parts or whole tractors, they sell both parts and whole tractors, they ship stuff. Uh, they got all kinds of stuff. I'm not the best at narrating, so I'm just gonna do the best I can. We've even got some sears. This is the type type on uh, the uh type of stuff I'm interested in but I've actually came and I've got quite a few of them that I just bought from here lots of sears stuff I know most of you that watch the channel here are into the sears and they even after me they still got uh, still got plenty of them Even got some snowmobiles here too. Got uh, all kinds of stuff. Even uh, things bigger than lawnmowers, like decent sized tractors, it looks like too. All kinds of goodies. Here's where a couple of tractors were that I got. I took the engines out of them because I didn't want them. A little sneak peek on what I what uh, I bought. And they've got uh, they've got like I said before, plenty of sear stuff left besides the hoods. So hopefully nobody needs any hoods because I kind of bought them all. A lot of Craftsman stuff. I mean. Whoa, I mean this whole row and he does have that uh, loader thing So if you want that one right in the very middle, he'll get it out for you. No big deal um, Some wheel horse I know they've got a whole row of wheel horse too. I will get to that in a bit Oh some more so I guess we got a bunch of wheel horse those are kind of neat, but if I get into something else, then I'm gonna have a problem with another brand of tractor, so I only did the Sears. Ooh. Zero turn stuff. Actually, the next two rolls are zero turns. That's kind of neat. And they got a lot of a uh, lot of stuff that you don't usually see. Like this is not something I've really seen before. I don't even know what that is. Ride King. Huh. There's some weird stuff. 
So we've got more, uh, this looks like commercial mowers, or golf course mower there, I think. Sorry about the wind noise, I'm sure that's kind of loud. Then we've got attachments. I mean, they've got a ton of attachments. I mean, I've, this is really impressive. I mean, that's, there's no words. Just too bad there's the snow here, so I can't really show you what they got, but I mean, they got like uh, discs, they got drags, they got, I mean, they've got, see, uh, um, I can't think of what they're called. Cultivators. Um, there's back there. There's a Sears mold rolled plow. There's a mold rolled plow in basically every brand, I'm sure. I've gotta watch where I step here because it's wet. And then all the John Deere stuff. I'm sure there's a lot of people that like those, so. I don't know nothing about them, but I'll make sure I'll at least get them on camera. I see they got a whole other, whole other, whole other uh, row up there of them. Oh, and they also got like stuff like golf carts. They even got golf carts. It's just amazing. Uh, it looks like I won't be going down there. Dang it. Um, so we got Cub Cadets here. Let's go down here. Wheel horse stuff. I'll go up and then turn around, I think. A lot of wheel horse stuff. I'd be, uh, if I was a collector of these, I'd be uh, overwhelmed of even uh, what to even start to buy or what to want because there's so many, so many choices. Then even on uh, MTD stuff, they've got, wow. I guess there's a train track there. That's, who knew? Cub Cadet. Here we got some some Bolins, and then where I can't walk anymore because it's all wet. So once again, I will put the name of the place in the description as long with their uh, the link to their Facebook page, so you can find them. If anything you want, just message them. I'm sure they have it. They sell, they sell both parts and full tractors. They ship anything. I even think they, uh, like Mordex and stuff, they ship via uh, Fastenal, I believe. And, uh, yeah. Doesn't look too bad up here to walk through. Some John Deere. Well, you can tell that uh, a lot of people have John Deere's because these are uh, well picked over as far as parts. There's a lot of, well, most of them are complete, but there's a lot of them that uh, 
You can tell that people have came and gotten stuff off. Uh, some simpli some uh, simplicities. I always thought these were kind of neat. Uh, I don't know what... can't read the numbers, but I always thought, because it's so small, that this looks... It's just kind of cool. The front end is kind of neat, too. Wow, those are... They got a ton of those little ones. And I think their property goes to here because that's when it kind of turns into something different. Big pile of MTD mower decks. Then back here we've got the, uh, oh, that's a big engine pile. When I say engine pile, I mean engine pile. That's, uh, that's crazy. Crazy in a good way, that is. Wow. All right, I think that's gonna do that for this video. I'm gonna have a video up very soon on what I actually bought from here. So uh, thanks for watching.